Hi, welcome to this tutorial in which I will show you how to turn your Excel file into a web application using Victor. Turning your Excel files into a web application is a great way to make it accessible and improve the user experience. So let's get straight into it. First, you will need to log into your Victor environment and go to the App Store. Here, you can click on the Create App button and you will see a window that gives you three options. We will choose the second. If you do not have an Excel sheet at hand, no need to worry. Victor provides a template that you can use. The template already has the next step completed. So if you do decide to use it, feel free to skip the Excel file preparation. The Excel file that I will be using is a simple beam deflection calculator. I have a sheet for my analysis, my plots and my data. To prepare our Excel file for Victor, we will need to add a Victor input sheet and a Victor output sheet. For my input and output sheet, I will need to stick to Victor's convention, so I will add headers for the parameters, units, comments, and values. Then in my input sheet, I will add the parameters length, width, and height as L, W, and H. I will give them a default value of 50, 10, and 10. Then I will replace the value in the analysis sheet with a link to the corresponding cell in the input sheet. Now I can make my output sheet. And I would like to add that the input sheet will need to be the first and the output sheet be the last in the order of the sheets in the Excel file. I will add the Victor convention again and I will add two results that I want to display in my application. I will add the maximum deflection and the maximum bending stress and link their values to the result in the analysis sheet. Once we have our Excel file set up, we can click on next and we can upload our Excel file here. Victor will automatically perform some checks and when you see that our Excel file has been uploaded and converted successfully, we can click on next. The next step is to give our application a name and a short description. Then we can click on create new app. To create the app, we need to make the files and install it. To do this, we choose the correct operating system. I am using Windows, so I will open the Windows PowerShell to run the following command. I can then copy, paste, and run the command and let Victor do the rest. This may take a few minutes, so don't worry if it takes a while. Once the app is done installing, we can open our code editor of choice to see the converted application. If we look closely at the files, we can see a spreadsheet. This is our spreadsheet and it functions as the backend of our application. If we open app.py, we can see some functions. And if we look at the first function, we can see that all our inputs from the Victor input sheet have been turned into parameters. If we scroll down a bit, we can see that the values from our Victor output sheet can be found in what's called a table view. Then we automatically have all our plots and finally a download button. To download the evaluated spreadsheet, should we like to have a copy of this Excel file with all the values in it. If you would like to make any changes to your application, app.py is the file in which you will need to make these modifications. You may have also noticed that the app is ready and running. This means that in the Victor environment, we can open our development workspace and see our application. We can click on, I have run the command. Victor will open the development workspace for us. As you can see, I have the inputs from my Victor input sheet on the left and the outputs I chose on the right. I can then click on the tabs above to see all the plots from my Excel file, like the deflection and the slope of my beam. This is a fairly simple example. Any complex Excel file can be turned into a fully functional web application in this way. And that is how you can convert your Excel file into a beautiful, user-friendly application to automate the boring and engineer the awesome.